So uh, I'm almost there to get Ella win. Uh, her mom said she'll be 15 minutes late. Um, so it's 15 minutes after two, which is when she'll be there. I think it's like 2.10 right now. So um, I'm running late as well, so. But I got fruit, stuff to get fruit for Halloween. This one's mine, all the lemon and stuff. I just got Halloween all, um, I should have actually, I don't want to think about it, but I should have got it mixed for her. I don't know why I got her all watermelon. Should have got one the same as me. And then, you know, let her learn how to eat mango, learn how to like, she likes oranges. That's what I like about this one, this guy. I always run by him. And I always kind of nod my head at him or whatever. But he actually has pieces of oranges. A lot of these places, they don't have orange. And it tastes so good with the lemon. That's one of my favorite things about drinking any like beer, well, like like Modelo in a can or something, is the uh, is all this stuff you put on top, like the lemon, the tahini, and also getting drunk, but not having to drink it, you know, in the effect. Oh, look at these nails. I brought my nails. I guess the bracket of women I get is cut down by like half already. But um, that mean the kid are looking to have a good day and go to the park. I feel pretty tired. I'm not gonna lie. I like feeling like this because um, I usually have a lot of energy and just kind of um, not um, being too energized or whatever. Just kind of being like in a mellow mood kind of like it i'll probably do some pull-ups at the park I'll, I'll, first i'll get situated let my daughter have her fun and stuff and, um, yeah i'll just kind of watch it from where i'm at so we're gonna go to the park and we're gonna enjoy ourselves and uh, hopefully she enjoys the fruit like i am at that park i'll eat some more i'm gonna sit her down she could eat some on the way to the park and she'll probably visit her grandma today it's a good exchange we communicate properly and uh, yeah, life goes on man I don't want to argue it's too tired to argue I don't want to argue no more I'm too tired for it um, yeah. I think today I got to pay my phone bill I can't remember so now, one advice I could give to any young people is mind your own business. Like, if you see someone that looks cool or looks like, like stop being insecure and stop like, you know, if somebody's like looking at you squinting, they're probably not even thinking about you. So stop like, trying to dog them back or like, I don't know. I get like that sometimes, you know? It's just part of, I don't know, it's just the society we live in, man. It's just a trip, but hopefully the vaccines come through. And then you got the president pardoning um, like these celebrities, and it's kind of sucks for the people who've been in there for many years, dude. And maybe are innocent, you know, and never have a voice, you know, because everything's like, oh, because everybody wants, oh, I'm the one that, you know, everybody, it's everything's for a reason. Oh, I'm the one that let that guy go, you know, as opposed to like just letting somebody go and no one's ever gonna hear about it. Like, who's that guy? You know, that guy can't do nothing for you. You know, but maybe these rich people you know that Trump's gonna pardon you know it looks good for him you know I think that's whack that's totally whack but um I mean it's cool for the people that are getting out you know, it's fortunate for them life's not fair I guess but um teach his own and um yeah just another day another day as you were humans, we were born with a spirit and a soul, but we also had like this outer outer appearance that we're so constantly worried about. Ooh, this orange is calling my name. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. You ever say thank you, Jesus? And like a part of you is like not to be selfish and like who's Jesus like I don't know the ego you're always like I don't know but that's that's like a reason why you should have uh, Jesus as number one in your life because so you don't think you're more than what you are you know 
least for some who are need help, you know, are not as fortunate. You know, some some people are born with good lives and peaceful homes. Not everybody, so. Yeah, so. But I'm um, sorry. But um. So I think I don't think Gwen is here yet, but um, should be here soon. And, um, I'm just chilling. So I just want to tell her. All we pretty much have to talk about is so what time. Um, is that one going to get picked up tomorrow? So I dropped off. So I'm not quite sure if Ellen's going to stay the night at her mom's house. I mean, my grandma's house. Uh, my mom's house. Or she's going to stay with me tonight. And part of me wants her to stay at her grandma's because it's, it's more homey more comfortable there she could like yesterday she was like grandma's house she was like grandma's house and then um she was like upstairs downstairs because my mom's house has stairs and um so yeah she's like downstairs because i guess when she's at my mom she'll say downstairs and my mom probably wants to chill upstairs or whatever but yeah so my legs are very tired um like in a super mellow mood and, uh, yeah, I don't want to go chill at the park with the friends and stuff. And, um, yeah, I'm glad I got fruit for her. That's what I didn't have yesterday. Got some fruit. We're not going to stay at the park that long because uh, I kind of want to go to the store still and buy her stuff to take her a bath and things like that. And, um, yeah, we're going to have a good time. Good time at the playground again. Let's take it one day at a time, man. Let's take it one day at a time. Let's take it one day at a time. So. Sandwich kind of got me full, so we'll eat that later. Maybe it'll be too soggy and stuff, but I just might finish it. Never know. Body ain't your friend. Body ain't your friend. Everybody. Okay, the kid is here. Elowen's here. Woo! Nice. Okay, so she can hop in the front. She can step on this to hop with, to hop to the back. And uh, yes, so I'm tired, man. To be real, like my body is just tired, tired. I busted a freestyle when I was faded before I went running. I like the lyrics, but I kind of like never like practiced it or anything so it doesn't sound like that good like the the, the rhythm or whatever <sighs> my stomach's kind of hurting like got these restroom but... there's no restroom at that playground over there so I don't know what I'm gonna do. other one's here so I don't think I'm gonna record this uh, interaction but uh these guys.